Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm going to be talking all about my new Lululemon belt bag. You guys seem to love my belt bag videos, so I'm just gonna make another one because I love doing reviews and like talking about products that I think are worth it and that I like. So before we get into this video, make sure you're subscribed and turn on your post notifications, follow me on Instagram because that would just make me happy. I wanted to talk about this new belt bag. They brought out a new line. It's kind of a nicer version in my opinion. It feels a lot more like rich and well made. I don't know if that's the best way to describe this, but I definitely like it. It's definitely different from the everywhere belt bag, extended strap, the like the original version. And I originally got this because of the really cute logo. You can kind of see it there. It's very subtle and it doesn't scream like Lululemon, but it screams Lululemon. I don't know. I just love it. So I'm just gonna like talk about some of the differences. As you guys know, I do have a little collection of belt bags. I do have the original plain version of the Everywhere belt bag in black, but I gave it to my mom. I didn't wanna sell it. I do have the white belt bag and it just looks like this. I'm still obsessed with this, even though it's a little bit dirty. I think it's so cool and I just really like the white color. It's a very bright. Don't get this confused with the opal color because the opal is a, it like has hints of gray, but this is like solid white. It's also very bright, which I really like. And then I am selling this. So I will link down below the listing if you want to purchase it. I have listed it on my eBay shop, but I do have this bag right here. It is the same version as the black one, but it's just tan with the white Lululemon logo. I don't know, it's a little too loud for me. Like it just like Lululemon, like right in your face. I love this color, but I just, I just thought it would get kind of dirty easily because my white one got dirty easily and it kind of sucks, but at least I can put this with the white laundry and like put bleach in it. So it could become brighter. I don't know, and try to get like some of the stains out. So first off, the biggest, um, I was gonna say the biggest red flag. Okay, so the biggest difference, like most noticeable difference is the buckles. This buckle, the white one, is plastic. And this buckle, as you can see, it's shiny and pretty like heavy duty. This is metal. This is a metal buckle, but this part is plastic, as you guys can see. Um, but the part that it slips into is metal. So the buckles are the biggest difference. The straps exactly the same. And also too, these bags are the same size. I was nervous that this was gonna be the two liter bag and I did not want that. I wanted the one liter. These both are one liter bags. And in my other video, you can fit a whole water bottle in this. So if you're concerned about it not fitting a lot, it can fit quite a bit. So. On the back here, these are the exact same. The zipper pull, obviously the only difference is the color, but the zipper pull um, on this side is the exact same. The front is different. So the front on this one, it just has the little logo here, but on the front on this one, it has the logo like super big. It feels like a faux leather, kind of thin, um, but it's a faux leather with the Lululemon logo. They each have, you can see it on the white one more clearly, but each of these have a silicone tag that say Lululemon on them. The zipper is also a huge noticeable difference. This, this one's so floppy because it has nothing in it, but this right here, this zipper is metal. This zipper is plastic. I will say this zipper is a lot more smooth. This one's smooth too, but I don't know. They're smooth in different ways. I think the plastic zipper is like easier, but this is also for a metal zipper. This one's pretty, pretty smooth, pretty good. Um, so I wouldn't like let that deter you from like buying which one you want, but still the zipper pulls, this one has a matte finish. And then this one's obviously glossy just like the buckle here. Sorry for looking at the viewfinder, but I'm just trying to like see if you can see it. But we have different finishes on the zippers. Both are metal and both are on the same, they're like the same design. So those are the differences between the bags. They all fit the same. I just kind of wanted to like show you guys. 
a few of the differences because that's probably why there's like a little bit difference in the price with these because of the little details being a little bit different having this be metal having the big logo here embellished there um and then the metal zipper it just feels uh, a lot more high quality and then also you can't really tell on camera but the fabric on this belt bag is a lot more like thicker feeling than this one i don't know it's hard to describe but it just feels more like better made like the materials in this bag feel stronger than the ones in my other belt bag so moving on i'm just going to show you what i keep in this belt bag because I don't know, I like watching these. So opening it on up, I kind of have it stuffed to the brim. But first I have my keys. I am just in the black era, like having everything like black. I think it's just like so sleek. I blame Alex Earl because I don't know, she just like wears a lot of like darker colors sometimes. I just like it. So this is the Never Lost keychain. I've already talked about this in some of my other videos. And then I have my AirPods. I got a black case for this as well, just because, I don't know, I like the way it looks. And then with a pop of pink, my little surgical technologist keychain. Next up, I have my glasses case. I keep them in this little pouch when I use the belt bag because I just find it to be easier to put in the belt bag. My glasses case, if you have like Ray-Bans or whatever, will fit in here. It's just, it takes up a little bit more room, more than I would like it to, so. Sunglasses, I've had these since 2019. I love them so much. They're the hexagonal shape. Next, I always keep my birth control in this just so I always know where it is. Next up, I have this hair scrunchie. My hairstylist gave me a little Christmas present and this is one of like the presents in there. I thought that was so sweet. I always keep it with me. Then I just have my wallet. Um, just because it just fits in here really nicely. This is like my purse of like all the essentials. So I always have this. Then I have a quarter and a receipt. I always like throw my receipts in here like when I get them so I can give them to my mom for her like rewards thing. Then I have a camera battery because it's always good to carry one just so you can have it. Next up, I have a couple hair clips here and then a couple hair ties. And this is for when I go to Cycle Bar I always know where my hair ties and hair clips are because after I got these like little uh, bangs, I always need the hair clips and then like baby hairs. It just annoys me so much to have them like in my face or like hair or touching me when I'm working out. Um, and then this is the last thing in the big compartment, but it's obviously my phone. Um, again, black case. I don't know. It's just like the theme. I just love it. I love how everything matches now. And that's everything in the big large compartment. This is exactly like the other version. It has one big pocket here, which I don't know if you can see that, but one big pocket and this is like made of mesh. Then flipping it on around, we have the two mesh pockets divided um, in the middle here. Kind of like that. <laughs> And then we have the back pocket. So my back pocket doesn't have too much. We have a pad, we have a tampon, and then we have a little key. This is the key to our like back lock on our gate. So I just have that in there. Nothing fancy. That's pretty much what that looks like. And yeah, so so I just kind of wanted to make this video because this is a, like kind of a different version of the everywhere belt bag And if you're contemplating on get it, I highly recommend it It's it just feels a lot more well made and I love the design and if you want to get one Check the link in the description box because I have the tan one the nude colored one up for sale and also too before i end this video i'm wearing this cute lululemon top this one is from hawaii because it has the hawaii logo on the back if you didn't see the short i made this was featured in it so check out my shorts 
if you want to. Um, because I did a little Hawaii haul, little goodies that my aunt got me. She's so nice. And yeah, so with that being said, I think I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.